and welcome back to Coco for Disney. I'm so happy and glad you're here. Today we have a box that has come in. And look at that box. I have cut it open. I haven't opened the box, but look at that box. Isn't that cool? This box comes from a friend who reached out after Sarah's Disney Magic um, inspired and created the Trading Traders collab. So today she has sent me a box of six pens and I have sent her back a box of six pens. And most of these are going to be blind pens or open edition pens um, that we trade. And when you open them to um, when you open them to view them, you will either choose to keep or pass those pens. So we are going to get into this wonderful box and check out and see what we have, okay? Let's get that box open. Oh, look how darn cute. Look at those little princess stickers. Oh my goodness, there's Rapunzel and Flynn. There's my girl Aurora and my guy, Prince Philip. There's, oh, that looks like Briar Rose. There's Mulan and Rapunzel again down here. And here is her, here, here's the card. So let's take this up first and look at this. Let's read that card. Oh, that's very, I love the flowers on that. And of course they're pink, you know I love my pink. <laughs> Hello, Pam, thank you so much for wanting to do this pen trade with me. It's always fun to get pen mail. Since this was the very last minute, I hope these traders bring you joy, whether you keep them or not. Have a blessed day. Cherie, is it Cherie or Sherry? Cherie, Surfer Girl 326. So this is her channel number. Make sure you're checking her out. Um, this is the first um, Trading Traders um, that we've done since the first one that Sarah um, has created. And uh, this, is kinda, this is kind of fun. I am um, getting in some Traders and you're not just doing one or two, you're doing six. So let's check out and see what she, she sent, all right? We have some beautiful pink tissue on the top here. Oh, and here we go. Yes. A Magic Kingdom guide map. I love these. I love these maps. At one time, I took uh, one of these and made coasters for my kids uh, one Christmas. So I love, there's several uses for these maps, believe me. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to show you what I see here. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. This is a lot, Sheree. Thank you. Let's open this one right here. Oh, look at that. Cute packaging. Love that. Oh, it's on this side as well. Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my. This is a Main Street USA pen, and this is Mickey in the Trolley. Oh my goodness. This is a limited release pen. Oh my. Oh gosh. Shuri G. Oh, this is amazing. Let's get into this. So I might need, I don't want to take this pen out of the packaging because the packaging itself is so amazing. Look, it's kind of like a little ornament there at the top. So, and I don't want to take that out, but look at that. Oh my gosh. That is a cool, cool pen. Oh my goodness. I'm going to take that out later and look more at that. That is a cool, cool pen. Thank you, Shree. Thank you. All right. We have more in here. I'm going to take the tissue out. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love Daisy. Family portraits. Oh, that is a cool card. Mr. Deck steps out. I remember that cartoon. 1940. So I'm not that old, but I know I used to watch a lot of Disney cartoons all the time. Cool card, thank you. That is very neat as well. All right, so I'm gonna move this box over and keep taking things out of it. Let's take this out. Oh my goodness. So this is one of the Princess Designer pens, another limited release pen. These, I, I know a lot about these pens simply because um, 
they are done by a designer and um, the packaging itself tells a lot about um, the designer and why they decided to design, design the pen as they did. And I believe this, yes, it is. It's a hinged pen. So if you see on the outside, it says the Disney Designer Collection, and when you open it up, it shows the full dress. And if you see on the inside, it tells you what print, which princess it is, which I could tell. I have seen this pen. Oh my goodness, that is beautiful. I love that pen. All right. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, look. She's also sent some stickers. They're the little holographic ones. There's Minnie and Daisy. There's Figaro, one of many. Oh, those are cute. Oh, and there's more. <laughs> Look at these. So adorable, so cute. Put those right there. And then she sent, look, a little label pen of Minnie in the purple and the pink. It's one of the little label pens that you can wear. That is darling. <laughs> that is cute. <laughs> okay, we got another package right here. Oh my goodness, this is a big one. Oh my goodness. I remember these pens. When these first came out, they were like the little VHS. So you could um, buy a pack like this and it either had a little small plushie in it or in this case, which I think it is, this is was for uh, Dumbo's 80th. This is five of five in the series. Look how cute. It looks just like the back of the VHS tapes used to look like. Adorable, and then they open. So let's see, it, there is a pen set of two. So there's two pens in here. Oh my gosh, how darn cute. There you have the pen of Dumbo. Look at how adorable that is. And then there you have the movie cover. Oh, and that's a, oh my gosh, is this a hinge pen? Oh, it is. This is a hinge pen as well. Oh, look, inside is the cassette tape. And inside there is the feather of Dumbo. Oh, how darling cute. I forgot about these being hinged with that. Oh my gosh, that is a cute pen set. Shuri, that is amazing. Thank you. Oh, so cute. All right, we're going to set that up here because that's too cute. Okay, so we have another one. Here's another package. So far we have three, which really four with that double set right there. Oh my goodness. Now I do have this pen. Um, this is a 50th. Um, these pens were very popular during the 50th, especially the Daisy and Donald. And look at that Daisy in there. But you see that um, the two the colors that'll change color as you flip it back and forth. That was really big for the 50th. The purple and the oranges and the pinks all flipping and blues all um, flipping back and forth. But look at them. Aren't they adorable? That is so cute. That is adorable. And I think these were a limited release for the 50th. I don't know that you can find these anymore unless you're trading. Very cool. Very, very cool. Oh my gosh, Sheree, thank you. We have another one here. Oh my. She's wrapped them all different kind of what, kinds of ways, which is really adorable. Oh. Oh my gosh, this is a Independence Day 2005, and it is a pen on pen. Oh my goodness. Cherie, this is amazing. Magic Kingdom, Independence Day 2005, and there's Minnie in her little 4th of July outfit. Oh my goodness. It looks like it's 3,000. 2005 pen. Oh, that is simply adorable. Very, very cute. Oh, I like that. I don't have any 4th of July pens either, so that is pretty cool. All right, we have one more, and she's got zap on this one. <laughs> and that is the empty, the box is now empty. She put a lot in there. Sarah, thank you so much for creating this collab. Um, trading pens is wonderful. I'm hoping Cherie likes the ones that I sent her. Let's see what she's gonna keep and trade as well. Okay, let's see this looks like that. I'm gonna take this pen back off. 
Oh, it's a Daisy Duck 4th of July pin. I collect Daisy Duck. So this one is definitely a keeper. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's like a 2003 pin. 2003 or 2005. I need to get out my magnifying glass. Even my glasses aren't helping me any longer. <laughs> I need help. Oh, I love the way the U, the S, and the A all are different pattern. And look at the star in that A. Sheree, this was an amazing. Thank you so much. This was fun to do. I love trading. Um, I, I collect Daisy, so I know I'm going to keep her. I had this pen, so I may trade, trade this. The Dumbo. I am definitely, I don't collect Dumbo, but this is too darn cute. That is just a cute little set. And the Daisy card I love. And this, um, the trolley reminds me, Main Street USA. Uh, those pins are amazing. This is going to also be a keep for me. Um, so, and many again, I got two Fourth of July. Why wouldn't I pair them up together? <laughs> And the Cinderella hinge pin. I do collect Cinderella. I do think she's very pretty. A lot of people are collecting these pins too, and they're harder and harder to find. Um, I believe when they first came out at the parks, they were like $39.99 for one pin or $34.99 for one pin. And then they hit the character warehouse and just took off. Um, so yes, I mean, that, I think this is the only one that I have. Uh, one of already and i don't have the rest of them so thank you sheree this was so nice you guys make sure you're checking out her channel see what i traded with her but sarah at sarah's disney magic started um this um collab of um trading traders so you guys make sure you're um if you have trades saving up um, send six pins to someone. Um, they um, can be any type of pins at this point. <laughs> I think Sarah started out to where it was blind pins or open edition pins, and I kind of threw some in there, and now Cherie's throwing some in there, <laughs> some pretty spectacular ones in there. So you guys make sure you're checking anyone um, out who's doing the trading traders, because um, it's going to be a ton of fun to trade um, within the community, and um, even with subscribers. I mean, you guys... I I know a lot of you guys trade pens and uh, want to trade pens around so check it out um, check in with Sarah's Disney Magic um, she's heading this collab up um, she can give you more details on it but I want to thank you for being here and letting me sh um, share a pen trade with a friend I hope you have a good day a good week and as they say in the parks have a magical day okay thank you bye now <laughs>